Hi, I'm Alex. I've been a Miami Dolphin fan for 16 long years. You start off the week as a Dolphin fan, you have hope. Your Dolphins are playing this Sunday. You're excited because they're going to win for once. For once, they're actually going to win. There's going to be no mistakes. It's going to be perfect. Then comes football Sunday. Say 11 o'clock, you're hyped. You get some wings, some pizza. You're ready to go. You put on your creamsicle Miami Dolphins Jarvis Landry jer shirt jersey. And you decide, you know, I'm going to sit down and be calm this game. I'm not going to be angry, sad, mad, because it's going to be amazing. We're going to win, score four touchdowns plus. It's going to be awesome. And they lose 63 to nothing. That's your season opener. You go into game two, they lose again on the road. But don't worry, they spent millions of dollars on a new stadium. It's great. But the thing about the Dolphins is, during the game, they give you hope. Before the game, you have hope. During the game, you have hope. And usually at some point during the game, you lose hope. And then eventually they give it right back to you at the end. Then the hope's taken away, very abruptly. Even though you, when you watch the Dolphins for as long as I have, you anticipate it. Then at the end of the game, they will give you hope again because they're starting to come back because we're a second half team. Then Ryan Tannehill, somebody will fumble, someone will throw an interception, somebody will do an illegal block, something will happen where they take the hope away. Don't give yourself hope right now because it's not going to get any better. I know there's only like six of us left in the world. That's it. I'm going to go cry now. Go Dolphins.